we're sticking with the world aways here about 26 of the day and we have colin maha from ireland in the blue corner his opponent currently getting the last minute checks in the vaseline applied on your screen is devon dixon from the united states maha wearing the blue outfit and dixon in the red outfit Kicks being exchanged between the two fighters. Back to that leg, back to that leg. Dixon opting to chop down the lead leg of Maha. Take him out. Forward pressure. Colin now forced to defend the single leg of Dixon. Bounce him, bounce him. Colin Maha did a great job forcing the head downward. Looking to push the head to the outside here. Watch for him to dive his underhooks in. Switch, yes, shoot the hip. Looking to hike his opponent up. Nice aerial takedown. Beautiful work from Devin Dixon. Devin now looking to establish the top position to pass the guard. Right arm back inside. Beautiful. Flip it inside. Right, stand up, head over. Yes. Big slam. There's the triangle. Look at this. Colin Maha securing the triangle in here. Switching to the arm bar. Look at the grimace on the face of Dixon. That arm is getting talked here, ladies and gentlemen. Colin really working for this position here. He could opt to still stay to his back and use the triangle. And look at that. Devin Dixon exposing the weakness. In the triangle of Colin and, it, and sneaking out the back door. That looked like it was nearly over, ladies and gentlemen. And Devin Dixon from the United States showing his resilience in the cage. Now working for the takedown. And look to drop to the double leg. Colin lacing in between the legs there of Devin. If you can do a toast order with your right leg, you can do it. Need the leg if you want. A minute left. This contest, big hammer fists from Colin. As Devon is looking to work for the takedown here. Devon with some good head pressure. Looking to secure the legs, drop down for the double. Looking to clasp the legs together here. Could look to drop down for the ankle pick. But Colin sensing that, widening the base, putting some more pressure through the legs. Colin Maha with some great takedown defense. He's really making Devin Dixon work for this. Back of the head. Ten second clap, it goes. And Devin's going to try and work for this single leg here. He's going to try and get his head to the outside, but opts to abandon it in fear of losing the position. Works some strikes towards the end of that round, but one interesting first round. Colin with the the submission attempt, the triangle, and then switching to the armbar. But we saw Devin Dixon really pull it out of the bag. Just checking the replay out here. Devin Dixon storming in for that single leg. Look at this big high crotch. Gets a massive slam here. There's the triangle. As soon as he gets the slam, that promotes Colin to cinch up that figure four. He just turned his hips a little bit down. Too, too, too far towards the canvas. He needs to point his hips to the sky to finish that take uh, submission. Excuse me. As we see the takedown here, there was the handiwork from Colin using the hammer fist to deter Devon from securing that takedown up against the cage.
Matsu. Colin now opening up with the leg kick early on. Devon looking to establish that left hook. Pouring out with a jab. Don't wait too long. Go back it up. Hey, there you go. There you go. Take your time, Stay Devin. Tight. Stay tight. Stay tight. Devin, you could argue, has got the advantage with regards to the takedowns, the wrestling ability. But Collins got some great takedown defense, but what Devin can do is use the strikes to set up. Oh, some nice shots here being delivered from Colin. And you can see every time he backs up, he comes in with singular shots. He's going to walk on to Collins' counters. Devin needs to start thinking punches in bunches. Finish with the leg kicks. There we go. Storming forward, but that's what he wanted. Wobbles Colin straight down to the ground. Ground and pound. Referee's looking on. Devin Dixon hunting for the finish here in the second round. There you go. That's it. Now step up. That's off the whole there you round. Go. That's Colin looking for the elevator sweep as his kind of corners call him. Could potentially give up the head and arm triangle. He's going to answer the phone to defend, but ultimately gives up the mount. Might give up the back here. Both hooks in for Devin Dixon. And will he go to the body triangle? And look for the submission here. The rear naked choke. He's got to try and get that arm underneath the neck. Here we go, flattened out. Devin Dixon looking for the rear naked choke. He's going for the short grip here. And this might be all over. The referee is sin enough. In round two, one minute 30, Devin Dixon from the United States gets the tap over Colin, Colin Miha from Ireland. Colin on the ground, disappointed, understandably. There's a very good fight between the two, but it was Devin Dixon's ability to use the takedowns. Look at this big overhand right, drives his opponent down to the cage. Massive ground and pound, which forces the referee to look on. And this ground and pound is what opened up the guard passes and, and ultimately the position. You can see the elevator sweep being implemented by Colin, which gave up the side control, gave up the mount position. And it was Devon threatening the head and arm triangle that promoted Colin to turn to his back. Both hooks in for Devon. And you can see Devon is going to force his hips back and drive the arm under the neck for the rear naked choke. 